All right, so a question I've been asked a few times on site is why do our brackets have these long slots in them? We can see the bottom of the L bracket has three holes to put the nails in, and the question is why don't we just have holes up here to put the nail in as well? Now, very quickly, if you stumbled across this video and you don't know what an L bracket's for, I'll quickly show you. So we've got one up here, and you find L brackets on internal walls which aren't load bearing. You can see the roof up here is actually clearing up above this wall, and we put the L bracket on, nailed to the wall, and then nailed into the truss, and that's gonna stop this wall from moving side to side. So if we have a look around this frame, any internal wall is typically gonna have an L bracket on it. We've got another one up there, and we've got them in any position where the wall could have movement. We've got a couple up here as well. And now I'm sure there's probably a couple questions. The first one is, instead of going through and nailing those brackets on, why can't we just attach a bit of timber and shoot the timber to the wall into the truss? It's definitely gonna be a little bit more sturdy than these thin metal brackets. And the reason we can't do that is because that will turn this wall into a load bearing wall. As soon as we have any fixings or anything attaching the wall and the roof together, it's gonna to turn this into a load bearing wall. And once this roof gets loaded with its weight, the roof is expected to sag down a little bit. And what it'll do is make a bit of a squeak in those nails and in that block. And that's exactly why we put these nails in the R brackets in the middle of these slots. So when this roof is loaded with weight, this truss is expected to sag down very slightly. And since we've got these slots where those nails are, this truss should be able to move down and the L bracket's still gonna be doing its purpose in holding the wall and the roof together. If we didn't have slots and we just nailed through the L bracket, or if we put a bit of timber there and shot into the truss into the wall, it could cause a lot of problems, probably a minor problem such as a squeak once the weight's put onto the roof. But basically the reason why these have slots is so that we can attach internal walls to the roof and for the roof to still be able to move up and down if need be without influencing the wall. 